it was a demanding league as it is uh, every year. Um, you know, very much a, an up and down uh, league. Got off to a terrible start really against Monaghan, um, but Monaghan showed throughout the league how, how good a team they are. So you know, when you, you reflect back on it, you know the the some of the, the, the games that we lost were against quality teams. Um, but we finished out the league well. Um, having to travel to Tyrone was was always going to be a tough game. We looked at that fixture back in January, and obviously our our uh, league status, uh, you know, really did depend on it um, and then we finished out well against Donegal also. Sligo uh, obviously had a had a, a challenge already in relation to flying out to New York, a lot of pressure on them, uh, a lot of people I suppose were, were, were sort of calling it as a 50-50. Uh, personally I always expected with the strength of the, the, the team that Sligo named that they would, would win that game and they did um, so they're going to come to Castlebar full of you know uh, optimism and, and enthusiasm to, 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 to take us on and we understand the, the massive challenge that be. It's um you know, I was even just looking at their their their, their team. They have a very good forward line and one that keeps David Kelly on the on the bench uh, is one that uh, can be formidable. There's teams in it in other provinces that have uh, many uh, many provincial titles and they'll tell you as much as any of the Mayo players that your know, provincial title still means something very dear to them so um, yeah certainly it's a that's a motivation but understanding that you know there's a there's a number of steps to take and that one that, that the lies in front of us in Sligo is going to be a, a quite a challenge <laughs>